We call our planet Earth, but the truth is that ocean would be a much more accurate name. Our Earth is a watery world. At least two thirds of it is covered with water. And if you go into the deep, almost anything discovered is new. Exploring unknown territory, gaining knowledge and understanding its key processes are challenging ambitions. Sure, we know a bit about fish, plankton, hydrothermal vents and continental shelves, but there's a lot more that we don't know, yet. And this forms a major challenge, as the ocean floor is not only abundant with life, it's also rich in all kinds of minerals, precious metals, oil and other hydrocarbons. Natural resources worth mining, but only if we are sure of what we're doing. If we can optimize results and minimize environmental impact, if we can operate in what is a largely unknown and potentially hazardous environment, if we can accurately assess the legal and moral implications of our actions and emissions, and if we can interpret today's findings for tomorrow's world. Now that's quite a lot of ifs. That's where the Royal Netherlands Institute for Sea Research comes in. NEOS is an internationally respected scientific institute dedicated to the furthering of knowledge of our marine world in all its complexity. NEOS researchers and engineers are very much aware of the growing needs of society, of industry, of commerce in today's world. By understanding the deep sea world and deep sea operations, and by supporting those making a living out of it, NEOS makes expertise available to the maritime world and goes to great depth in developing solutions by engineering special tools and instruments geared to specific needs by offering a full range of consultancy and operational services for those venturing into the unknown in search of new opportunities. Responsibly, sustainably. Why? Because NEOS believes that looking after both our planet and our economy is the way forward. The new Deep Sea Science and Technology Center is combining all experts, expertise and equipment to do just that.